All right, everybody! New York City's open, motherfuckers! This is Comedians at Skate Parks. The concept for this show was skate during the day and do comedy at night. And if I could make that a show, I will. And I did. And now we're doing it! Uh, Welcome to the financial district of Manhattan, New York City. Home to the Dwayne Reed Ledges, a handsome handful of black granite blocks coupled thoughtfully across a forgiving and crisp flat ground on the corner of, um, uh, what is this? Uh, it's in front of a Walgreens, I think, or a Rite Aid. You know what? Who cares? The Dwayne Reed Ledges I chose specifically because they're one of the most beloved spots in all of New York. I truly hate this spot. I'm from New York. These ledges suck. All right, I'm not a huge fan of this spot myself, but not because of why Pedro hates it. I hate it for my own reasons. It's the height, like it's deceiving. It looks as lower than it is. No, nah, it's not that. Just well, the way it's that for me. <laughs> it can be something different for you. I, yeah. It just feels like it. Yeah, yeah. Exactly what I said. Suck. Dude, boy, this is the struggle now. Every clip here is a miracle. Miracles happen here. That was a miracle. If you can get a clip here without a bus running over your board after having to sweep pedestrians off the ledges like fucking pigeons and avoid a one percenter texting his mistress without getting hit by a bike or knocked over by a group of tourists, then you just achieved something truly miraculous. Even if it is on paper just a tail slide. But that's not why I chose this spot either. I chose this spot because the ledges themselves remind me of our guest today, Mark Normand. These ledges are smooth, but rough. He's pretty smooth, but unapologetically rough. His late night appearance count is going into the teens. He's got a ton of specials, and he's also a real skater. I suck, I'm gonna get that out of the way. <laughs> I'm so stoked he's here today, and I think he's going to love these ledges. I think that ledge is, is bunk, as we say. Yeah, well, fuck. Or look at this thing. This thing has never been touched. Poser. Were you a thin board rider? I was a thin. I like a 7.5. They're a little stiff, huh? Yeah, that's good, though. Whoa. You got a key or you got a tool? I'm a tool. First kick flip of the day, folks. Watch your dicks. Oh, I really thought I had that. Every time I mess up, I want you to kick me in the shin. Oh, thank you, sir. You're like a skate angel. Just a smooch. Switch, who are you talking to? Yeah, was that backside? Is that a backside grind? Hey, what do you know about a nose manual? Woo, watch that shoulder. Thank you, bicycle. What was the last uh, video you watched, Mark? Whew, Jesus Christ. Probably Toy Machine, Welcome to Hell. <laughs> Last one? Yeah, I just watched it over and over. I like that video. When you walk around doing shows and shit, do you, do you still like look at of, spots Of and course, stuff? Like, you can't help it. It's like being a pedophile. It yeah. never goes away. You can fight it all day, but And it's, you would know that. That's why I'd still skate, you know, hang out with the kids. I find all the time I'll be like walking around, I'll be like, hold on, I want to go like look at the staircase. Yeah, every now and then. They don't get it. They think you're like uh, weird and schizophrenic. I always just tell them I'm an architect. <laughs> I'm a city planner. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, where are you at? I'm What's the uh, cop to leave? He's making me nervous. No, we could take him. We That's why take he's him. scared of us. Yeah, he's got the. That's uh, the thing with skateboarders. It's like we do carry around a weapon. You got that right. Like, privilege is not working on he's this not gonna uh, do corner anything. here. Now he's just watching. Yeah, now he's just a fan. Sorry, sir, sir we're good. All right, nice guy. Cop didn't give a shit. Third battery. <laughs> battery park. Nine volt. Eating ass. All right, here we go. Just doing word association? Yeah. Is, that, is that your writing process? Here we go. That's a good looking bitch. <laughs> When, what was your like go-to shit when you were a kid? Backside flip. You used to be able to do a kick flip, front side nose slide, shove it out. That was like the highlight of my this life. This way? Yeah. Shove it out. Yeah. And then. Yeah. Ah! 
Too slow. Come on, come on. Yeah, that's Too it, Mark. Slow. People say uh, sports were the biggest life lesson for them. You know, they learn discipline, they learn perseverance, hard work, skateboarding. Same thing, and we had to do it to ourselves. No coach, no teammates. And nobody wanted us around. And nobody wanted us around, just like comedy. Yeah, it's the, it's the original ambush show. <laughs> yes! All right, all right, that one's better. Ooh. Nothing sexy on a nice tray flip. Sorry, sorry. Get it, get it, get it. I'm gay. Go, go. Ah. Charles Grodin died. I don't know if you heard. He's a comedian. Oh, that was weird. Couldn't get it out. Barely got it out. Oh, up, up. False start. <laughs> Dick cheese. Son of an anal. Son of my asshole. Whew. Out of breath. I'm old. I don't want to get the ugly one. Honestly, I skated more when it just before I was a dad. Oh, That's cool dad. That's really what did it. Yeah, cool dad. We got a dilf here. Yeah, do you want a water? That line was crazy. Is that the line of the day? You all right? He said he's getting water. Oh, all right. I thought he quit. Asked if you wanted one. Oh, I missed all that. <laughs> ah! That was the cleanest one, and I fucking queefed out on it. I was gonna go shirtless, but uh, we'll lose the mic. Yeah, hey. you're uh, eager to show off that body, eh? Well, I just feel like I'm really getting into the NYC gritty vibe with the shirtless. We'll Look take it. the mics off at the end, we'll both go uh, shirtless. Really embarrass your, your kid. Oh, <laughs> well, that's too little late for that. <laughs> He's like a pretty smart kid. Is he Asian? No, the people <laughs> always like, oh, I must get it from his mom. Well, they could have got some of it from yeah. me. Yeah, is he athletic? No. Uh, I mean. So he's Jewish. All right, this one's for you, Dad. Come on, son. I wish you'd call me. Go! <laughs> uh. oh, uh. We almost had it. Can we edit that? <laughs> oh, skateboarding's been around long enough now yeah. that like the old men who were doing it when they were kids, where yeah. they're like, oh, I'm nostalgic right. for that era in my life. Right, yeah, totally. I was single, I was drunk every night. It's spontaneous, yep. it's fun all yep. the time, you know? Yeah, we're lighting fireballs and shooting shit out of a car and what do you call it? Trailing a car or sketch? I did that last yesterday. Oh, did you? Good for you. They, they almost killed me. Ah, but they were nice. I mean, we've talked about it since we've known each other, basically, right? Like relating the two things totally, to each other. Like, totally. So similar. I mean, it's similar. Like someone could watch skating, and be like, "Oh, that looks cool." Yeah. But unless you do it, you don't actually know all the nuance exactly, of what's going on, right? Exactly. Uh, and like every ledge or stairs is a crowd, and sometimes the crowd sucks. But you gotta learn how to get it. Sometimes the ledge sucks, but you gotta keep fucking waxing it. You gotta get the fundamentals. Oh, you gotta love that. Some skating. people start and they are, have a crowd already. Right. But skating doesn't work like that. Like, no, there's no way no. to skip steps. Exactly. And there's no, I'm likable, so I land tricks. <laughs> you know, you gotta land it. That's what Reddit is great for. I mean, Reddit's a bunch of angry cunts, but. They'll tell it like it is. And they go, yeah, this guy's famous, but he sucks. And I feel like skateboarding is that, you know, like, except the concrete tells you. <laughs> you you die on the concrete with the skateboard and it's all on film. And you, somebody <laughs> sees you split a rail and then sometimes you bomb on Conan. That's on film. Yeah. So it's similar. <laughs> well, have you heard the Seinfeld clip of him talking about it? Like, if Chris I see a kid Rock. skateboarding, I'm like, he's going to be all right. Chris Rock. Yeah, yeah. yeah him, him and Chris, and Chris Rock. Rock. That, that clip blew my mind because I thought he would hate, you know, he's wearing a blazer. He's clean. I thought he would hate us. We smell like shit. Well, we're dirty. Course. And we're in there. We're breaking their stuff. And we're breaking their nice Like, we're buildings. outside of Jerry Seinfeld's yeah. house, like, grinding the steps. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> but he was, he got it. He's a little more gritty than people give him credit for. More comics than you'd think have a respect for it, you know? Yeah, yeah, that's true. Well, we all grew up doing something, whether it was football, 
baseball, hockey, skateboarding. Well, skateboarding is better than all that stuff. Uh, <laughs> Everybody needs a fat coach with a beard DL out of it. We, we have that inside.